going to read a china kata for you all, and it's called Desire Binds Us. Those who catch monkeys prepare a pot with a small opening and fill it with some sweets. This is delicious. The monkey who desires food would put its hand inside the pot to take a big handful of the food. I must take as much as I can, it thought. Thus, the monkey is unable to draw its hand out through the narrow opening. Oh, oh, my hand! I can't take it out! Only on realizing the grip will the monkey be able to take its hand out. Ah, it's the desire for food that has bound my hand. It thought. When man sheds his desires, he will be able to live in the world freely. Ha! Huh, now I'm free! To get freedom is to surrender all desires. We think that the world is binding, but the world is lifeless. It is the desire that binds us. The moral of the story is, this wide world is like the pot. It's like that pot. And our stumps are us, or families, are like the narrow top. Our desires are the sweets in the pot. Man puts his hand into the pot and gets bound. The end. I hope you like the story, Siren.